Started playing footy around, around about eight. Started, started from Ozkick. Carrying a bit of weight too. A bit chubbier back then. Yeah, after that, my mum got a job up in Jolton. Ended up moving up there for about four, four years. When I first played up there, we couldn't get in the under 12 sides. So I, I basically just went into my brother's side. He's three years older than me, so I was playing up against like blokes older than me, yeah. And I think at the time there was Jagger Mira up there, um, Simon Tunbridge. They were big back then, so I was I was a little bloke then too. And chubby. <laughs> well, I had to sort of read it off the packs and stuff like that, but my brother was in the team as well, so he would he would give me the ball as well and help me out and get me into the game. So that all works out so far. I think the AFL is sort of getting faster these days and I think you need it you need to be fast. I realised when I was quick about stay school boys 15s, yeah. Just got the ball and ran and, and noticed I was faster than the other blokes. Got lucky in chase, so I'm just knowing that like it makes you run faster. My most joy is probably when I'm running out of the wing and maybe dodging a few blokes and then and kicking goal. Love doing that, so or maybe a screamer. Love screamers. I think I need to get better at my, probably my work rate, working both ways, mainly defensively. Also probably running sort of to the right spots to get the ball instead of running nowhere and, and sort of not getting the ball and sort of not getting rewarded for your effort. Well, on my dad's side we have Isa, Isa Davis, um, yeah, first cousin to Leon Davis. Dad's got his number and he, he said to me if, whenever I need help or he, any questions, ask him about it, yeah. My mum's side, she's a, she's a winmar. She's related to Nikki and... And yeah, she's also a collard as well. Got a good, got a good background and family and stuff like that. Mum's a lawyer, so she's in the um, ALS. That's the Aboriginal Legal Service, mainly mainly with the Children's Court and yeah, just with the with the Indigenous kids. Um, and then you got Dad. He works at a works at a high school. He's an Aboriginal officer, and he and he helps out with the sort of the kids that are, are struggling in, with their in class. Maybe the ones that are a bit loud in class, and yeah, he just sits on the side and, and sort of mentors them. Yeah, being Indigenous is probably one of the most important things. Um, just you got to, especially setting setting good examples for Indigenous people. Probably got a stereotype, stereotyped as sort of maybe dropping out or off off ground issues, and just like not all the not all players are the same. And I think it's all about support as well, like your family and stuff like that. And I've obviously grown up the right way and and had good support, like with my mum and my dad. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Breaking that stereotype is, is probably one of the most important things. Um, it's worked hard, you know, up to this point, and I don't want to throw it away just for, for little things. I, I want to be one of those Indigenous players that sort of come in into the system and sort of last, last, you know, like Leon Davis, like 12 years, you know. I wouldn't, I wouldn't care where I get drafted. I just want, yeah, I just want to get drafted. Any team will do. I don't mind moving out of, out of WA, out of my comfort zone. Yeah. As long as I get drafted, basically. Yeah, all we always said was always want to make AFL. Me and my cousins and stuff like that. So I'm the only one at the moment now, probably close enough there, and hopefully, hopefully I do reach that goal.